Recently, water advisories have been posted at some state lakes around Ohio. The advisories were posted because of the presence of bacteria known as blue-green algae. The blue-green algae could produce toxins that may pose a health risk to you and your pets. What is blue-green algae? Blue-green algae, as it's commonly known, is not actually algae at all. It's a bacteria called cyanobacteria that can use the sunlight to create nutrients to grow. It's a naturally occurring organism that grows in natural and man-made bodies of water. Blue-green algae grow when the weather conditions are just right. Dry, sunny days, coupled with calm waters, allow the algae to bloom. Although it has the potential to produce toxins, the mere presence of blue-green algae does not necessarily mean that there are toxins in the water. What does blue-green algae look like? Blooms of algae can look like slicks of blue-green paint on top of the water's surface. A closer look reveals a grainy appearance. Most blooms in Ohio will appear greenish or black. Sometimes the algae can be confused with other aquatic plants like duckweed. If you see blue-green algae on the water, do not touch it and report it immediately. I think I saw some of the blue-green algae. Who do I tell? If you spot what appears to be blue-green algae, please contact the Ohio Department of Health, the Ohio Environmental Protection Agency, your local health department, your local watershed coordinator, or the property owner or manager, ODNR for state-owned lands. A water advisory was posted. What does it mean? A water advisory is a cautionary measure to help you make a wise decision to protect your health when considering entering a body of water. A no-contact advisory means that an algae bloom has made the water unsafe for recreation. You are strongly advised to avoid any and all contact with or ingestion of the lake water. This includes the launching of any watercraft on the lake. A public health advisory means that an algae bloom has been reported and has made the water potentially unsafe. You are advised to limit contact, avoid ingesting lake water, and avoid contact by children and pets. At several state parks that have had harmful algae blooms in the past, signs are posted to help you see what an algae bloom might look like. What precautions should I take during an algae bloom advisory? There are many steps you can take to protect yourself. Avoid contact with waters that have advisories posted. When in doubt, stay out. Immediately rinse yourself, family members, and pets with treated water after contact with lake water. Never allow your family members or pets to drink lake or river water. If you feel sick after being in water, seek medical attention immediately. Now that you know what blue-green algae is, how to identify it, and how to stay safe, have a great time enjoying Ohio's many state parks, wildlife areas, and nature preserves. We'll continue to monitor the algae's presence and test for any harmful agents in the water. Your safety comes first.